Hello everyone and a warm welcome. In this video presentation, I'll explore essential multiple choice questions MCQs with a brief explanation from Unit 5 of the JKSSB Female Supervisor Exam, specifically focusing on physiology and promoting health, Part 2. Dear viewers, I also encourage you to study the detailed theory behind these MCQs through internet searches because there is always a possibility of errors in answers. For MCQs on other topics, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Let's attempt to solve some important MCQs one by one with brief explanation, focusing on the topic physiology and promoting health. Question 21. Which of the following is the primary function of white blood cells, leukocytes, in the immune system? A. Carrying oxygen. B. Fighting infections. C. Clotting blood. D. Transporting nutrients. The correct answer to question 21 is option B. Fighting infections. Explanation White blood cells are crucial components of the immune system responsible for defending the body against infections and foreign invaders. Question 22. What is the primary function of the thyroid gland? A. Regulation of blood sugar levels. B. Control of metabolic rate. C. Production of digestive enzymes. D. Maintenance of fluid balance. The correct answer to question 22 is option B. Control of metabolic rate. Explanation The thyroid gland produces hormones that regulate the body's metabolic rate, influencing energy production and utilization. Question 23 What is the role of serotonin in the nervous system? A. Regulation of sleep and mood. B. Control of muscle contractions. C. Digestion of carbohydrates. D. Maintenance of bone density. The correct answer to question 23 is option A. Regulation of sleep and mood. Explanation Serotonin is a neurotransmitter that plays a role in regulating mood, sleep, and appetite. Question 24 Which organ is responsible for filtering and detoxifying blood, as well as storing essential nutrients? A. Spleen B. Liver C. Pancreas D. Kidneys. The correct answer to question 24 is option B. Liver. Explanation The liver filters and detoxifies blood, stores essential nutrients, and performs various metabolic functions. Question 25 What is the primary function of the thymus gland in the immune system? A. Production of insulin. B. Maturation of T lymphocytes. C. Synthesis of red blood cells. D. Regulation of body temperature. The correct answer to question 25 is option B. Maturation of T lymphocytes. Explanation The thymus gland plays a crucial role in the maturation of T lymphocytes, T cells, which are important components of the immune system. Question 26 Which type of muscle is under voluntary control? A. Cardiac muscle. B. Smooth muscle. C. Skeletal muscle. D. Involuntary muscle. The correct answer to question 26 is option C. Skeletal muscle. Explanation Skeletal muscles are attached to bones and are under voluntary control, allowing conscious movement. Question 27 What is the primary function of the myelin sheath in the nervous system? A. Enhancing muscle contractions. B. Transmitting nerve impulses faster. C. Producing neurotransmitters. D. Regulating hormone secretion. The correct answer to question 27 is option B. Transmitting nerve impulses faster. Explanation The myelin sheath is a fatty covering that insulates nerve fibers, allowing for faster transmission of nerve impulses. Question 28 which vitamin is essential for the synthesis of collagen and wound healing? A. Vitamin E, B. Vitamin C, C. Vitamin B6. D. Vitamin K. The correct answer to question 28 is option B. Vitamin C. Explanation 
Vitamin C is essential for collagen synthesis, which is crucial for the structure of skin, blood vessels, and connective tissues. Question 29. What is the primary function of the ciliary muscles in the eye? A. Controlling the size of the pupil. B. Changing the shape of the lens. C. Producing tears. D. Sensing light intensity. The correct answer to question 29 is option B. Changing the shape of the lens. Explanation The ciliary muscles adjust the shape of the lens in the eye, allowing for the accommodation of near and far vision. Question 30 Which of the following nutrients is a major source of energy for the body's cells? A. Proteins. B. Vitamins. C. Carbohydrates. D. Minerals. The correct answer to question 30 is option C. Carbohydrates. Explanation Carbohydrates are a primary source of energy for the body's cells, providing fuel for various physiological processes. Question 31 What is the role of antioxidants in the body? A. Enhancing muscle strength. B. Fighting oxidative stress and free radicals. C. Regulating blood pressure. D. Improving bone density. The correct answer to question 31 is option B. Fighting oxidative stress and free radicals. Explanation Antioxidants help neutralize harmful free radicals and reduce oxidative stress, contributing to overall health and disease prevention. Question 32 Which of the following is a water soluble vitamin essential for the formation of red blood cells and energy metabolism? A. Vitamin A, B. Vitamin D, C. Vitamin B12. D. Vitamin E. The correct answer to question 32 is option C. Vitamin B12. Explanation Vitamin B12 is crucial for the formation of red blood cells and plays a role in energy metabolism. Question 33 What is the primary function of the parasympathetic nervous system? A. Triggering the fight or flight response. B. Slowing heart rate and promoting relaxation. C. Increasing blood pressure. D. Enhancing cognitive function. The correct answer to question 33 is option B. Slowing heart rate and promoting relaxation. Explanation The parasympathetic nervous system is responsible for promoting rest and relaxation, slowing heart rate, and conserving energy. Question 34. Which mineral is essential for maintaining healthy bone density and nerve function? A. Iron. B. Calcium. C. Zinc. D. Magnesium. The correct answer to question 34 is option B. Calcium. Explanation. Calcium is crucial for bone health, nerve function, and muscle contraction. Question 35. What is the main purpose of stretching exercises in a fitness routine? A. Increasing muscle strength. B. Improving cardiovascular endurance. C. Enhancing flexibility and range of motion. D. Boosting metabolism. The correct answer to question 35 is option C. Enhancing flexibility and range of motion. Explanation Stretching exercises help improve flexibility, prevent injury, and maintain a full range of motion in joints. Question 36 Which of the following is a key component of a balanced diet? A. Saturated fats. B. Processed sugars. C. Fiber rich foods. D. Artificial sweeteners. The correct answer to question 36 is option C. Fiber rich foods. Explanation Fiber is an essential component of a balanced diet, promoting digestive health and helping regulate blood sugar levels. Question 37 What is the primary function of the excretory system? A. Regulating body temperature. B. Filtering blood and eliminating waste products. C. Producing hormones for growth. D. Transporting nutrients to cells. The correct answer to question 37 is option B. Filtering blood and eliminating waste products. Explanation The excretory system, 
including the kidneys and urinary system, filters blood to remove waste products and excess fluids. Question 38. Which of the following lifestyle factors is associated with better mental health? A. Lack of sleep B. Regular physical activity C. High stress levels D. Excessive caffeine intake The correct answer to question 38 is option B. Regular physical activity Explanation Regular physical activity is linked to improved mental health, reduced stress, and enhanced mood. Question 39. What is the recommended daily water intake for adults to maintain hydration? A. 1 liter B. 3 liter C. 5 liter D. 8 glasses, approximately 2 liter The correct answer to question 39 is option D. 8 glasses, approximately 2 liter Explanation. The general recommendation for daily water intake is around 8 glasses or about to lighters, for adults to maintain hydration. Question 40. Which of the following is a modifiable risk factor for osteoporosis? A. Age B. Gender C. Lack of physical activity D. Family history The correct answer to question 40 is option C. Lack of physical activity explanation Lack of physical activity is a modifiable risk factor for osteoporosis. Regular weight-bearing exercise helps maintain bone density and strength. Thank you everyone. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel Education and Teacher Education at Shoki Bilal.